I've just been in McBride, spent overnight in McBride because I'm doing a video on my accident you know, for my anniversary. And uh, it, McBride is also the place that my dad grew up. And so I wanted to um, just go wander around the town and see things. And I had heard that um, that McBride had plaques on a lot of the historical buildings that um, gave a history of each building. And, um, and so I wanted to go and look at these buildings and uh, see what they were. Sorry, construction. And maybe take some, some of the shots back to my dad if he's interested in looking at all that. I just wanted to look through because I know my dad has talked about people from McBride a lot and so I'm sure that a lot of the names that I would see on those plaques um, are going to be names that I'm probably going to recognize which is kind of cool. So I did that today. Um, here's a little montage of what we looked at today. when places embrace their history too it's really nice to be able to go and look at what things might have looked at looked like back in the day and McBride has really um, gone above and beyond and, and uh, put out plaques on a lot of their buildings that explained who owned them and what they were as businesses in the past and it's really quite interesting to walk around the town and just see everything like that. to apologize for a lot of these pictures. Um, the fisheye effect had been turned on on my camera and so most of these pictures and some of the ones even from last week in Jasper were all with the fisheye effect which kind of distorts them but I didn't want to throw them all away and I still wanted to show them all to you so I apologize for the weird shapes of many of the pictures. It's just great, not sure if Now he's looking for food. He knows there's food in here. Yeah. But you're not getting any. There's the house that Dad lived in. My dad spent many of his growing up years in McBride and this is where he lived. We left McBride, we headed to Jasper, and this is Mount Robson on the way to Jasper. It's the highest peak in the Canadian Rockies. Well, I've been in Jasper for two nights now. This will be my third night, and I'm Heading home tomorrow. It's been a really great trip traveling around. Um, spent the first night in McBride and it was about uh, like I was there to film. That's where I broke my back. It was close to McBride, a place called Dunster. So I wanted to get some footage and just look around. Also, it's the place where my dad grew up. So I wanted to get some um, pictures of his old house and I don't know, I just wanted to look around. So it's been really good, but Jasper, this campground, is really nice. I really like it. Um, it's called Wabaso. Well, I'm on my way back from Jasper and the highway is closed at about Three Valley Gap, which is between um, Revelstoke and Sycamus. 
and I'm having the feeling that they've opened it up because all of a sudden they let all those, they had a place where they stopped all the semis and had them park on the highway about 16 kilometers east of Revelstoke. But it looks like stuff is, they're letting things through, but it's sure backed up. I'm not getting on. See, everything's, and all the semis that they must have let go are coming down the hill and can't get moving because it's bumper to bumper. I don't think I want to get stuck behind all that. I just can't imagine being stuck behind all those semis, semis, semis going over the mountain highway. How slow they end up going up some of the hills. So I don't know. I don't think I'm going to leave yet. Well, I did make it home from my trip. I've been back about a week now. Uh, I stayed in ja or sorry, in Revelstoke for another couple of hours I went over and visited my aunt who lives there and locked my keys in the car she got one of her friends to come and get them out for me but anyways it was a really nice trip I really enjoyed my trip to Jasper and McBride um, in August maybe sooner but in August I'll be putting out a video of the real reason I went there my um, anniversary of my accident is on August 14th and so I want, wanted to do a video that sort of um, just talks about that. So that is upcoming and that's all from um, this trip. All the video is from this trip. So I hope you enjoy that one. I hope you enjoyed this one today. Um, thanks for watching and we'll see you next week.